Hi everyone, I'm Christine and welcome back to my sewing studio. Um, I just wanted to put together a quick video for this week. I don't have a sew with me on anything and actually I started making this poncho. Um, it is uh, this guy. So I started making this little girl's poncho right here for my craft fair. It is Simplicity 8524. Um, I didn't do a sew with me on it because I'm really trying to get it done quickly. Um, I've got this, I had this extra fabric. This is some fleece that I've had. Um, this little girl, it's a little girl's poncho. You don't, it's really tiny. This is how short it is. Um, this will be called the Zoe. It's actually the adult poncho, the women's poncho I made from this fabric is called the Trish, named after my neighbor. And um, I really like this fabric. It almost reminds me of a Burberry fabric. But um, since this is the little girl version, I named it Zoe after her daughter, Zoe. So um, I'm working on this. I have a hat I'm going to be making out of this fabric, but I also wanted to show you some stuff I just ordered um, from Joanne's website. Um, I have these purses, um, actually hold that thought. This was one of my UFOs I talked about, unfinished products that, um, I had started making last year and I'm finishing it up for this year for my craft fair. I had such little to do on it. I just had to put the lining in, which is a striped lining and I have to do the bottom, um, put some foam core in the bottom to make it stiff. But I've got this little Santa um, purse, and I'm actually going to do some of these other purses that they've got. This is McCall's in the craft section, number M7884. You see that? So I made, I think I, this that I made is the small Santa purse. But what I want to do is, um, I love, I love this white purse with the Christmas trees on it. So I found some fabric on Joann's. This is one of the Christmas fabrics. So it was, it's just a cotton and is a little more than I wanted it to be. I mean, I think it ended up being $6 a yard, which I don't like spending $6 a yard on cotton, but um, I thought it was really cute. So if you could see it, it's red and white. It's white with red and green polka dot along with a little bit of silver and the silver is sparkly. So it's got a little bit of sparkle to it. So I wanted to make this white purse. It's going to be the M7884 and I will do a sew with me on it. Um, but for the trees, it says to use foil transfer. So I'm confused, I don't do foil transfer a lot. So what I did, I've got my Cricut machine and I've got the Cricut iron thing, which you can also use a regular iron. But um, I went on to Amazon, because of course, Joann's has certain Cricuts, Cricut products, right? Well, I went on to Amazon and I found this foil transfer, or it's a heat transfer, it's a heat transfer. So I've got all the sparkle colors. I've got some pinks. Um, I will send a link to, I'll put a link up to this because it wasn't very much. I think it was maybe $23. I told my husband it was a little less than that. I think it was about $23 on Amazon. But what I love is I've got the silver, I've got the blue. Um, I've got more silver in here. There's gold and there's green and a dark green. Perfect for Christmas. So I am going to, before I do the sew with me um, and make that purse, I'm going to do another video where I try this out on fabric. Not this fabric, but some of my other cotton fabric I've got. I'm going to cut out some trees, maybe at least one, see how it works and so that I can make this purse. Um, I love this purse with the trees. Like I said, I want to make it and sell it at my craft fair. Um, if I like it, I'm also going to maybe do one, maybe do the one with the um, stockings. And I also bought some really cute little buttons to put on the top of the trees. I found some really cute snowflake buttons. 
Um, these were all on Joann's also. The buttons were on Joann's, the fabric were on, was on Joann's. I just bought this on Amazon, the sparkle stuff. I also found some fabric. I know you'll all be shocked. It is plaid, <laughs> believe it or not. Um, I found some blue and white. This is this was in their um, sale section online. And um, it's an indoor outdoor fabric. So normally it's pretty expensive, but I was able to find it, I think about six, $6.99 a yard. I bought two yards each, about this one, and then a red, blue, and white check fabric. Um, I will put those links on there also. It's just a little stiffer. So what I like to do with this fabric is I like to make this purse. I've actually got a couple purses I've made like this. This is the C and so number B5741. So you find this one in the at Joann's in that's an at least in my Joann's, it's along the wall. It's not in all the drawers. Um, it's the C and so, and it's just like along the wall. It's like $1.99 for these patterns. And I love this purse. I've made a lot of them. And this stiffer fabric is perfect for that. So I've got those. I'm going to do the see and sew on that, or the sew with me, I'm sorry. I'm gonna do the sew with me on that purse. I'm gonna do the sew with me um, on this other purse that I'm gonna make. And I'm also making these, this le these Santa legs. This is Simplicity 8032, and it's got these Santa legs, if you see that right there. I've made these before, I actually, found this um, velvet, it's the fake velvet, it's the velour, I think they call it, right? Um, on sale on Joanne's website as well. I ordered that, it just hasn't come in yet. Um, I've got some leftover of this um, fur here, and then I think I've got some more of this stripe, which I actually used in this purse, to make these Santa legs, and they are so cute. I'm hoping to make two of them in one tr in one time because I am going to be selling that at my craft fair as well. So I just wanted to do this video real quick. I just was really excited. I got this little mini fabric haul and um, wanted to let you know what I will hopefully be working on soon. So um, look for those videos hopefully soon, like I said, and um, I'd love to hear your comments. If you have any questions, please let me know please like and subscribe to my channel and I will be doing this video and I will be doing my Friday sews, possibly on Friday. If not, it'll be Saturday. Thank you so much. I hope you have a great day and I will see you soon.